Am I mistaken? I, I thought there was delay. Well, hi everyone! <laughs> they not doing stream delay this journey? Optional. Optional, cool. Wish I had known I, that. All I right, well, you do. I'm sorry. I had no idea. <laughs> uh, hello everyone, welcome. Uh, we're doing some cross keys. <laughs> I just got some fresh coffee. I'm here with Lana Bean. This is the uh, 2023 cross keys tournament. Week one, we got Gilgamesh versus Captain. And uh, did, did I miss any cool items yet? Don't think so. Okay, cool. I will be your tracker and co-host. So Captain immediately found Eastern Palace at uh, Lake Fortune Teller. Uh, their uh, sank start is at Magic Bat. And Gilgamesh is going the wrong way. Bone the wrong what you said Lake Fortune Teller is Eastern? Okay, I will make a note of that. Cool. Alright. <laughs> it's I thought, fine. I thought I had so much time. I thought I was fine. Alright. That's kinda cool. I didn't know that they weren't that that uh delay was optional. That's I wish I had known that. I would have been probably a little bit worse than enjoying it. TBH. I, I totally thought you knew. Apologies. <laughs> it's alright. We just, you know had nothing going on right at the beginning. It's fine. It's it's early cross keys. But nothing happens in the first bit anyway. It's true. Gilgamesh finds some money though, that's nice. Money in a pot, small, one of many. And Captain finding the most important item. Oh death oh my gosh. <laughs> the most important item, death. <laughs> that's a pretty oh. rough uh, dark room this early, though. Found a bug net, though. That's pretty important. And Gilgamesh finds a connector up to uh, Hyrule West. Ooh, with Palace of Darkness up top. That's not bad. That was uh, the other side of Super Bunny. Do you remember where the, the front of Super Bunny was? Was that over in the Kakariko area? It was. I think it was either... I think it was Bomb Hut or... Maybe the front of Tavern. Okay. I will make a note of that. Nice. Uh, a little too early to really want to be in pod, to be honest, because, you, you know, don't really have much you can do. You do have one key, so you could at least get the, you know, the first three items. So right. we'll probably see that. 
And if you can clip without a bottle, an extra two checks too. And Captain finds the dam and quake. This little dam over here on the east side of Hyrule. So are these... I'm guessing these are just your basic cross key settings. Nothing's really changed. I think the only change that I remember is they've swapped it over from 100% inventory to 100% locations or the vice versa. So you're never going to have like a key lock key situation. I think that's dungeons. accurate. Yeah, so you're not going to find like a six pod key lock pod key basically. Okay. I think. Things like I that. I like that change because that's... It's kind of an annoying situation when you stumble upon a, you know, a pod small in the vanilla big key chest or stuff like that. Stuff you would never be able to predict unless you just kind of did it. Exactly. I think you're still allowed to find other ones. I'm pretty sure I found a four key lock pod key in the back, but that's about it. I'm going to see a little bit of mimic clip action here. As Captain finds a connector up to... Whirling Brothers West, only a, a compass up there. Oh, this. Oh, no. But the Butterless Mimic Clip was going so well. Getting really close. Uh, we got a big key to TR here in chess game. See ya, Mimic. See you later. I like that Gilgamesh just let him ride up the entire length of, uh, of that, uh, <laughs> wall instead of, like, Flipping him around so he goes down the bottom instead. Right. Nice, nice extra bomb throw there. And we also did see, uh, I believe that was the top of the Paradox Cave here on the uh, south of Kakariko for Captain. Obviously, not enough weaponry to be able to comfortably go in there and do that. So we're going to have to find something. Full hard container, out of pod, nothing else even sequence broken, it looks like. Yeah, that, man, it's usually how it goes. You mimic clip, you get, like, literally nothing, or you mimic clip and get boots, and you're like, ah, oh, man, this is such a good idea. Pretty much. Like, here's your big 20, congrats for clipping. <laughs> here's your 10 arrows. Oh, nice. Dude, the early cape. This could be nothing. All right, anyway. <laughs> oh, did he find a cape in pod? Okay, I missed that. Convenient, though. We already saw two more dungeons over in the Kakariko area. We've got Hyrule Castle and Ice Palace. So. Really starting to take note of these early uh, these early dungeon finds. Obviously can't do much in some of them and, you know, find some firepower to get through, like, in front of Hyrule Castle. Lana, are you doing this tournament? Why, yes, I am. I lost yesterday. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, that's fine. I had a tough opponent. It's fine. I'm still learning. Still learn. That's that's the important part. Yeah, this uh, this journey kind of snuck up on me. Oops. Um, <laughs> Captain has not defeated Desert Palace yet. Um, I didn't even know, like I I did not know it was it was uh, up and coming. And then by the time I knew, I had, I had like maybe four days to decide if I was gonna do it or not. It was like me within a week or two of uh, it ending. It already had like almost 120 entrants or something. I was like, hmm. well, I, I, gu I, I guess. <laughs> uh, let's, let's go. <laughs> I think I've just I've done so much uh, of the, the door randle at this point with the pseudo boots that playing anything linked to the past without some sort of starting speed uh, is just doesn't. <laughs> just doesn't interest me as much anymore. Darn those door randles. Ah, the door randall. Blessing and a curse. Oh, there's the other, another Paradox Cave entrance. So two of them right away. And Gilgamesh comes in with eight bombs, so gonna full clear it. Man, Captain gonna go ahead and farm a couple more bombs here in Palace of Darkness. A shield! More money! Mm. Stupid shields our second 300 already. That's really nice. Yeah, not even gonna have to worry about uh, doing any holy handing this seed. Yeah, there's that cape there on the pod bridge. Well, nothing from Hyrule top mid, so maybe bumper's important. 
Maybe. Let's get a big key to Skull Woods, a Bloomerang, a small key to TR, and 20 bucks. 20 bucks. Where are these swords? These runners are looking for swords. Everybody knows that. That's what I'd be looking for. No complaints there. Early boots or early sword? What would you choose? Uh... Like Link's house start. You're not going to get the other one for an hour. Well, it's, oh, well, then boots. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Obviously, yeah. If it's like, what would you choose if you got the other one like 20 minutes later? That'd be like, yeah. Uh, I could probably put more value in a sword than boots for the first 20 minutes of a seed, but an hour, hmm. All right, well, we did find Upgrade Fairy at Hype Fairy, so bomb upgrade options with the money they've got, but that means no Zora money. Yeah, it's a shame this isn't a you know, Shop Sanity or something. Buy some goodies from there. I wonder if we'll ever see Shop Sanity go, like, mainstream internees. It wouldn't be that bad, because it's just shops, right? There aren't that many. Yeah. I I still think it's better in, like, a entrance shuffle format than, like, a vanilla one. Um, in my opinion, it's kind of like how I feel about the take innies in retro. Like, I like them in entrance shuffle. I don't like them at all in non-entrance shuffle. I agree. Entrance shuffle just makes it too monotonous. You're, you're finding an entrance... You gotta track it if it has something good, and an entrance you have you're less likely to have early money than a regular seed. Mm -hmm. Bugnet. Right, so Captain getting some time back Gilgamesh got from not doing this quite early or didn't see it early. So the only thing that could hurt Captain right now is if there's something in Vicky chest right now. Yeah. That's a that's a kind of a rough spot to isolate this early, or just in general. Even though it's not in logic without, you know, a lamp, it's still kind of like, if that's something nice, then you're sad. <laughs> exactly. If you're going to dive Eastern and you're doing anything down the, the front two checks, you, you want to get that big huge chest. That just feels bad if you die. Mm -hmm, for sure. Ooh, Looks like we found, yeah, desert entrance. Uh, we do have the small key, so with the these bombs, Captain could get at least three more items in here, as well as info on what's on the torch locked by the boots. Oh, oh, little heart piece. It only has something if you skip it. Like, I'll see Desert, I'll go now, nah, I'll go back later. It's got, like, boots or a sword or something like that. Check it early, it's like, mm, here's your here's your big 20 or herpes. Mm-hmm. Interesting, Captain... Oh, okay. <laughs> Captain was gonna go check the exit, but I don't remember it having that small key. It means two more items over here. Would be important. Yeah, and you never know when these seeds are gonna... Oh, hold on. Small key to Ganister. All right, well, that's, that's not fine. gonna that's not gonna hurt Captain for now. So maybe not even at all. Fifty bucks, and we're out of here. I almost thought that bomb wasn't gonna hit. Me too. Yay, bomb hit box. That's a shame. I didn't catch. What was was that a key that was on the island? I did not see that. It was, was very quick. It was yellow. I know that, but couldn't tell if it was a big key, small key, medallion. Ooh, okay. Right side desert kicking you out at dark world potion. I missed where the front of desert was. Was that? In, I think that was in Kakariko as well. But as much as I don't, as much as it pains me to say it, I know I've been wrong. And I could be incorrect here. But we'll You're never wrong, just sometimes not quite right. It's yeah, fine. there you go. I like that attitude better. I'm never wrong. Forget the rest okay. of what you said. Just, just, just the important part. 
Went back and rolled the tape. Looks like a small key on that island. Okay. Which could mean freaking anything. It's like Dave? skull word, thanks. Uh, it could be maybe it's the swamp small. You never know. Dancing woman. And you're ignoring her. Well, I guess you're in that area, that's fine. Yeah, that's that's a it's kind of an annoying spot to find a connector because it's like, but I don't want to isolate the other two entrances over here, because what if you get like a blind hut or a mini mold burn cave? And another Dark World point exiting out of desert over to the known as the Dark Shopping Mall area or Dark Ice Rod Cave area. Not horrible. Um, good access to Dark World and kind of annoying, especially if you don't get flippers for a while. Mm hmm. Wire Shed with a compass, followed by another big key to pot. Of course. Thanks, game. Even though that wouldn't have made a difference, it's fine. Guess we need, what, one more pod key, I think, to make a difference there. Yeah, one more would let us get to the back, and then you could do some, uh, some hammer, hammer jumps. Get over to the big chest. Hope they like their dark room in pod, if needed. <laughs> Where's that lamp at? Everyone's been asking for it. It's behind Ice Armos, where it always is. Nah, I don't like that. Yeah, just a very... And it looks like Gilgamesh is going to walk back up and check that connector that's up here in the East Palace area. But you got to have your fire rod to go to right side, GP, not left. That's how this game works. It just makes sense. <laughs> okay, we're going to pick up some bombs. I kind of like going back and checking this connector, because once again, like... Coming back over to the East Palace area is kind of a pain in the, the butt. So if you can clear everything over here in one go. Nice save. Uh, what are you talking about? Nothing. It's fine. Oh, wait. We already saw this on Captain's side. Okay. Right, 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 right. This just led to, I think, compass or something. Yeah, it wasn't oh. anything special. Yeah, but compass welcome is... Back to, welcome back to Gag Rico. <laughs> Compass is not even very useful in this uh, this mode. Uh, it's, it has a lot more value in something like a, a door randal or a uh, pot sanity or something. Pot sanity or a, bo a boss shuffle. That's, that's when it really stands out. That's true. Because in this doesn't compass just gives you like the item count for dungeon. It does. It's compasses are just useless fillers. I've always said in this mode, they should just give you the numbers and turn them into $5 or something. <laughs> just get rid of the compass. Just get rid oh. of it in this mode. Why am I that, I didn't even catch that on cap inside. There's Misery Mire. There's TR Big Chest over at the Sick Kid. A lot, of, a lot of dungeons in close proximity. What the heck? And Brother's Or house. Orling West. <laughs> it's almost vanilla. See where this takes us. Ooh, bomb oh, that's, shop. Rob, I gives you three more entrances. Do you? Oh, I know Mira though. Yeah, I don't know. It's a tough call to go for something like that. I'd say I'm more prone to do it if there's less to do in the overworld. If you're running out of things, just do it. But we haven't even seen them go south yet, so we don't even know what's at the dam drain. Yeah, we haven't even. I don't think we've even been up into like uh, the um, the Lost Woods area. Second. Oh, yeah, we haven't even seen the Lost Woods yet. Here we go. 
Oh, it's everybody's favorite early connector, Spiral Cave. Welcome back. We've got one dollar stun prizes. I know you're 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 invested. A whole buckaroo. A vanilla. What the heck? I'm definitely invested in a whole buckaroo. And you've got Spiral Cave, a pack fortune teller. So who goes first to get their mirror on the other side? Another big ice palace. That's a lot of really big keys. Two useful ones, too? Not so much. But not horrible, because this means if you go to the front of Skull Woods, you can clear out everything. Yeah, another Oh my god. What the heck? <laughs> Which one's this? Eastern. <laughs> uh, yeah, I hate to see it. That's legal. <laughs> that is a check that the game is okay with you getting with nothing else. Ooh. Oh my god. Push grass. You'll have to see that too. Yes, you do. I mean, eh, we don't really need that much money already because we already found the two three hundos, so. Yeah, big games are, uh, and Potter are about your biggest three expenditures at this point, so money wise, unless you're going to be investing in potions, you're good at this point. Yeah, that's true. Right, we're still looking for that cack well. I don't think we've seen where Ganon resides either. There's Ga oh, oh okay. yeah, we have. There he is. All right, so we are gonna need to beat uh, Castle Tower this sea just to get to our friend Ganon. So good news, bad news. You're you're gonna get your boots. Bad news, they could be your gummo. No, oh, don't say that. <laughs> don't say that. Don't put that out in the world. Sorry, I didn't make the seat though. So if you have any problems, blame the person who rolled it. It's fine. I'm not going to blame the runners. No, they're, you can't. They're, they, they they're already suffering. They didn't roll it. Oh. Third party person rolled it. I'm not I'm not naming names, though. All right, we got Hookshot Cave leading us to Village of Outcasts. That's actually a really nice, uh, a really nice character to find. Not right now, but potentially for later. But I mean, with, uh, there are, you know, like, we could still find the very funny, you could find Hype Cave and the the guy in the front gives you your Moon Pearl, that's a possibility. True. Uh, we still that, haven't seen... I mean, There's, we... like, a couple things. Like, you could find a connector that goes up to Death Mountain. Yeah, that's that's kind of one of the earlier things you're looking for. Uh, or you could you could find a mushroom to have to turn it in to walk all the way there to get it, you know. <laughs> No, I don't like that. <laughs> oh, this bunny walking is rough. This is also like another I don't know, it's it's almost another thing that kind of works for and against the idea of shop sanity. As in with Shop City, there's so much more likely that you need to, like, bunny walk to find an item in a shop to, like, progress you. That's true. There are several shops that you could walk to as a bunny. Which, on one hand, makes bunny walking a little bit more beneficial, advantageous, you know, it's less of a, a bad choice, I think. But at the same time, nobody wants to bunny walk. We still have so many other cool things we can do instead. Look like just a hard piece on bumper top. You're scatting buying another 10 pack of bombs, because why not? You got all the money you want. Yeah. Might as well. It's only a weapon you got. So, kind of hard to use a weapon as a bunny or whatever the heck this bunny spray is. Uh, this is Deadpool, and I think that's like an early costume of Deadpool. I don't even know. Uh, but it looks like Gilgamesh is the first one to actually take the plunge into Spiral. Now is the time to do it. Boy, a whole lot of nothing here in the Dark World. Oh, another compass. Lovely. Yay! Thanks, game. Maybe this is our Death Mountain. 
A and survey says. No. But. It's Arby's. That is a, a good spot to find. Though obviously you'd rather find it with, uh, with, moon, uh, with the, the mirror already, but you know. Oh, it's the only worst part about going through Spiral is going through it twice. With <laughs> yeah. No boots, no sword. At least Spiral's like in an early location. The worst is when you're in, you know, you're up on like Death Mountain or somewhere really far away and it's like, no, nope. I don't want to do Spiral game. Because then I have to do a bunch of crap to get back here. You know. Exactly. It's like a last resort check. Mm -hmm. We're still also looking for that hack well, so we'll probably see, uh, unless this is a connector or something. Nope, just the rear shot. Uh, fake flipper back over to check the fairy drop down. Could be our well. Could be our well. We're also, I think, still looking for Uncle, too, and we could find that at the escape drop down and avoid having to get a glove to get whatever's there. Have we even seen Bat yet, either? Or Bat? Bat, Bat was over by Hyrule Castle. We might, oh, okay. I don't think we've seen fairy yet. There's something. Hey, more money. Yeah, I'm sure that's what Gilgamesh was hoping for. Oh man, my wallet's not full enough. And Captain about to be just as disappointed, but we do get a Hyrule Castle check. Or Sank check, I should say. Lumbering with a big key. Oh my gosh. Uh, you know what this means, Willer? Mm -hmm. This means the well is banned GP. No. That's evil, game. So we might have a required Aga 1 and 2 this seed. Definitely a required Aga 1. I, I, I know personally I've had plenty of cross key seeds come down to a GT climb or not. When you do it. It's tough to make that decision, but when you've got like three keys, a bow, a fire source, and you find GT, you're like, come on. Mm -hmm. It's definitely an easier choice when you have a cat well sitting behind the Agatu clear, but right. I, I, I've been there where you clear top of GT and Cacwell and find, like, you know, a random small key that you don't really care about. <laughs> right, it was logically required for a skull small for the back, but... Oh, was weird. Okay. That's it. I mean, but if you, like, find GT and you've got good enough gear, you've got, like, a couple of swords boots, fire source, you're just like, whatever, just climb. Yeah. Could have a hammer, hookshot, who knows, and if you have hookshot climbing, that's even better. Well, there's our castle tower, so good to know. Yeah, it can be interesting as well, because of the whole entrance shuffle, you know, you could find GT reasonably early, and get a, a, a basement clear, and then it's like, do I really want to go back for the climb and the big chest at some point? Mm. What I want to know, Lana, is what the heck is, uh, what's the next play? What are we, what are we, what are we looking for? What are we hoping to find? What's it going to be? Yokovic Yo is already doing it. I mean, it's going to be south somewhere at this point, so looks like Captain may be going the same direction, but unless it's a Gina, chances are it's mini Mulderm or Ice Rock Cave area. We've seen, I think, everything up to this point, other than that. Or uh, a Spectacle Rock. Okay. Oh, I hope I <laughs> Captain has regrets. I don't even know how many bombs it takes to kill these guys, but I would, I would certainly not be making this play. So, oh, if this works out, this could be big. Well, this could be a big waste of time. Oh, okay. They really don't take that many bombs. I thought they took more. Hmm. Alright, well, Spectacle Cave didn't really do much for our friend Gilgamesh here. But we did find another important 
uh, connector, FTR connector. I'm wondering, it's kind of looking like... Well, we do still have Front of Hyrule Castle and those two connectors. I think that's what Gilgamesh is looking for right now. If you're talking, I can't hear you. Microphone issues? I don't know. There he goes. Welcome back. Yeah. Thank you. Unplug, replug, that's fine. Man, what's it? What's what are we looking for? What's it gonna be? I think we just have to find. It's gotta be one of these Hyrule Castle exits at this point, maybe. Well, we did find Desert North at Ice Palace entrance, but... Or Ice Rod Cave entrance. That's it, though. Yeah, and of course, without the Hyrule Castle small, these two checks that uh, Gilgamesh is about to do are not in logic. I'm gonna use up the rest... almost the rest of his bombs. Gonna have to go pot strats on the last guard. Oh! <laughs> Ah, uh, the classic guard laser vision stopping your boomerang. Oh, that laser vision. Oh, that laser vision. And Gilgamesh gonna go to... Okay, Zelda, so I'm surprised with... Oh, no, no, never mind. With uh, with Sanctuary where it is, that was fine. But I don't remember either of them dropping down on the back of Sank. Uh, did I just miss it? Uh, yeah, they got both of those. That's where one of our big keys was. I think it was oh, the Meyer okay. big key. Uh, yeah, I thought that'd be weird if they didn't, because you got bombs, you go to the back of sink. Right, what do we got? Small key to TR. Well, that's not doing nothing for us. This is kind of a rough start. We just really don't have that many... Things. <laughs> yeah, I think Hyrule exits are our last choice here. Yeah, aside from some random one off or bunny walking. It looks Captain. like Cap. Yeah. Going for the bomb jump. I like it. Mmm. That's a spicy sequence break. And Captain's like, wait, 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 go back. Wait, <laughs> this is good. Hold on. I, I really like that bomb jump. I've definitely had seeds where, like, that was my... Uh, like, that ended up getting me to the Meyer area or something. Oh, Way absolutely. out of logic. Which Probably obviously fun, yeah. wouldn't be helpful at this point as a without a Moon Pearl, but... Right. Or, like, you find something important, you're at the south end, you got boots, it's like, well, time to practice oh, oh, oh. Nice the sword spicy... find. That's a sequence break right there. Yeah, that's, that's already paying off tremendously. <laughs> See if Gilgamesh can have some good luck getting the Dark Cross for this check. Hold it. Almost. Where's that chest? Wait for it. Hold it. Where is it? Small key to Meyer as well at Ice Rod Cave. I don't even know where Gilgamesh is. I'm assuming Gilgamesh is in the room with the chest, right? And is... Ooh, okay, all right. That took probably longer than he would have liked, but that was a really good find. Both runners with a good sequence broken item. That is a beatable Eastern for Gilgamesh. Yeah, I didn't think about that. And, you know, without that sword, is a decent weapon to have early as well. But at the same time, Gilgamesh knows that is extremely sequence broken, and you are here, and your progression could be at one of these exits, so you don't go to Eastern immediately. No. Uh, it's Eastern is only for two checks, and also continues to be out of logic. Oh. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. Wait. Uh, that was uh, unexpected. Uh... 
Okay, let's try the other door then. Uh, they both found the same exit, different worlds. That was mm -hmm. hilarious. That's great. Okay. Ooh, okay, floating island. It's a good find. And it could be required, so you got three entrances, you've got your turtle walk entrance scout. Well, five entrances, but you gotta choose between right or left. Yeah, I don't know if I'd want to try and bunny walk past the Lionels, so hopping down here is probably the better choice. Not scouting TR entrance, though. Oh, hi, Swamp. I'm finding all the dungeons. But not enough progressions. Ooh, okay. I heard that little jump. That means we found the uh, Mount Rescue Cave, which is really good. That'll get us to West Death Mountain. That'll also get us a rescued old man, which will give us save and quit point. Is there a lamp in the eastern big chest? <laughs> that would be is that what we're Is that what we're missing right now to put Gilgamesh's checks here in Logic, including the bow? That would be stupendous. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I think Captain popped out one of the, uh... I think it was one of the Paradox Cave entrances to get to I'm... South Dark World. Womp, yeah. Oh! <laughs> There's the old oh, man. Okay. What's up, Gary? We'll rescue you later, it's fine. It's, uh... that, that's not a horrible save and quit. No, it's not the best, but... That would be really funny if that eastern big chest just had a lamp in it. I mean, I've had, like, a mountain save and quit at High Ferry, and then Link's house for the start, and then your sank start is is just like Hyrule Castle. It's, it's the worst. Oh, yeah. It's like, oh, well, everything's on the west side of the map, so getting to the east is the, just going to take a heckin' long time. There's Blind's Hut. Okay, this will really kind of tell us if Lamp is the thing. If there ends up being a Moon Pearl or something here, yeah. It could also be Flutin, East Big Chest, maybe, is possible True. as well. True, True. Or we'll find a connector we didn't check. Another Pod Small Fire Rod. It's a good find. Now you can go into Ice Pads. Ugh. Yay! Ugh. That's Meyer 2 overall, one on Gilgamesh's side, but Captain does have one of those Meyer Smalls, so you yeah. get a hookshot or something, and another Meyer Small, then left side looks pretty spicy. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, let's see what else we can find up on the mountain. I'm trying to think oh. what other connectors we hadn't seen yet. Oh. Captain's getting a triple dip in the Eastern. Oh, that's yeah, worth it. well, I'm curious to see what this big chest is. This is going to lose him a little bit of time, but at the same time, it's like. Be a bow. You never know. I was gonna go do Dark Cross anyway. Though Captain hasn't done the first, you know, the front of Hyrule Castle yet at all. But then again, you know, that's only one check in logic, so that's reasonable. Put that off a little bit longer. Hey, there's a sword. All right, both players have swords now, and they're both out of logic. You. Yeah. But what's in this big chest, Captain? Tell us. Is it lamp? Us. Is it flute? Is it moon pearl? Show us your ways. It's a small key. The, oh, wait. That, do, that does nothing. It does nothing, but that's good to know. It's good to find. We like it's, that it's, item. It's required. Big bomb info. Eve's in Eastern. I think that's our first bit of dungeon info. It is. We got billions of compasses. Trillions, in fact. But... Trillions. Never ending. But not a map. So... What the heck is our logic, then? Bunny walking somewhere? I think that's all we haven't seen. I mean, have we seen outcasts? Did anyone yeah. walk to outcasts? We popped out of Outcast for one of the players. It was on the other side of Hookshot Cave. Which Hookshot Cave was up by Lumberjack House. Ah, another dark cave. Lovely. 
I'm just feeling we're missing a hookshot for the game to send people to Meyer with no logical sword. Can you even hurt the wizards with bombs? Yes, you can. Ugh. Ugh. Good news is for both runners, they both have sync with broken swords, and one of them has a bow, so it's fine. But still, ugh. yeah. We're heading into Eastern. Again. You know, a clearable one. Uh -huh. And obviously, that fire rod we got is out of logic, and. The uh, entrance shuffle doesn't use the whole fire rod for dark room logic, so yeah, we're, we're, we're not we're not we're just we're just we're just digging a little deeper here. <clears throat> Let's see, we I think yeah, that hookshot cave connector to village of outcast area is. Probably what we're looking at here, but like, what would we find? What connectors have we still not found yet? We found Super Bunny, we found Paradox, Spectacle, Hookshot Cave. Did we take that old woman connector? Dancing woman? Maybe? I thought. Oh, yeah, we did. Her... That led to, uh, that led to left side of Maze Race. <laughs> So that was the I really think we're gonna find Hype Cave with a with a moon pearl in it. Or uh, or a mirror. Or a hookshot. Or a hookshot. The dream. Blue well, doesn't look likely with what Gilgamesh has found on the mountain. Well, Captain's gonna have a little bit easier of a time going through the front of Hyrule Castle with that sword in hand. Let's see if Captain also I'm gonna assume Captain will probably also go for the uh the Dark Cross bow. Be a little bummed out by seeing that, but still better than nothing. Very true. Okay, I wanna see a good armos fight here, go Gomesh. Don't mess up! Don't mess up! Well done. And not even... Oh, God. What? Wait. There's a lamp out there. There is a lamp out there somewhere. And we gotta find it. We're missing the lamp. But we've got the fire rod, so we don't care. Okay, this thing's getting just out of hand now. With Moon Pearl, we can... Oh, no. You so where much the... now. Where the heck is our lamp? I... Where do you even go at this point? I don't even think Gilgamesh knows. I think... Oh, no. I don't remember if that was Captain or Gilgamesh that went through Hookshot Cave. I think it was Captain, but... It was Captain. Maybe we'll see that on Gilgamesh's side. Did we ever see the Dark Death Mountain checks on the west side? I don't think we did. We did on... Uh, we just saw... Yeah, we saw on Gilgamesh's side. It was a bottle in the K-45 and then a dark cave on West Dark West Dark Death Mountain. Okay. Yeah, this is the hookshot cave plate. Good backwards boomerang throw by Captain. Well done. And there's but the who's, other Meyer. Who's gonna remember to throw a boomerang after they kill a boss or after they pick up a, a crystal? Before they pick up a crystal, then. So it just floats in space forever. A spinning boomerang, you gotta mean it's kinda like in in Birdie. You, when you have full health and you're going into GP, you gotta swing your sword a couple times for the crystal swing. Of course. It's a good thing. Of course you gotta. Why not? Alright. Now with Moon Pearl in hand, this game is kind of wide open. Well, we're still looking for a few more things to blow this wide open, but you can at least enjoy the Dark World without being a bunny. And Captain does need to do Dark Cross, which he's got that sword. It's running out of health, though. Yeah, gotta be careful. If, if, oh, uh, Captain, Use the cape! If, Use the cape! If you die, stay. Go back to Dark Cross. Please use do, the cape. 
Do not leave. I'm so nervous, Horror. <laughs> that, that moon pearl is double locked by that lamp. Holy moly. Nice. Okay. Gets it. Ah, uh, that's so good. I was really worried. The... I had a, I had a little time. It's fine. <laughs> Can't find when you want okay. to die, the snakes disappear. Right. Having to take a bomb death instead. Catherine, we need you to go back to Eastern for sadly a third time. Well, I assume once Gilgamesh is done here, we'll probably head towards, uh, I mean, we'll probably double back and go to Skull Woods, right? It has the big key, has Fire Rod, can do quite a bit in here. I think the Moon Pearl gives us new checks we haven't seen. Skull Woods, Thieves Town, Bombable Hut, aka Brewery, and Dark Cack, and Hype Cave. I think we've bunny walked to every other entrance. But yeah, that I I think so. We we don't have any like East Dark World access yet. We don't. So flippers or a mirror, hook shot maybe. Mm. I likely have progression. Not sure what Captain was. Oh, Captain found the old man rescue and is locked into the that cave. I believe that's what's going on over there. Especially if you save and quit, and it takes you back to a dark room. It's a, it's a pretty good indicator. Yeah. It's through. I'm just going to have a Master Sword here pretty soon, though. Yo, Commission, good bomb set up. What's in this big chest? You have a big 20. Bams. Eh. Eh. Bams. It's fine. Just what we always wanted. I mean, Best we're obviously thing. not going to find a lamp in here. Yeah. I mean, at this point, Gilgamesh has got to play this like any other season. You're like, okay, at this point, I'm missing a lamp, and I don't care. I'm just going to explore. <laughs> mm -hmm. You got that fire rod, so you're going to be able to clear out the back of Skull as well. Our back of entrance. Oh, wait, we found this. There's the other sword, isn't it? Uh, yes. I know this is at least Fire Rod and another Pod Small. I think it was a sword. Of it. What the heck is that lamp? <laughs> the people, good, they want to know. Good question. Okay, nope. that's... Uh, another Meyer Small. I, the fire, the sword was just sitting up here somewhere in a random cave. Yeah, you'll get it. It's too much of a pain to get back up here. You're clearing everything you can. And back of skull. What do we got? Oh, bonk rocks. <laughs> yes. Our first map. It's and actually it's useful. A dungeon we don't know. Your first map, but you're like you're gonna find your bomb shop and get your red crystals and like immediately find maps for both those dungeons. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. that happens far too often. It's like that or you just talk to Saw and it's like, oh, here's the map to that dungeon. You hold off on Ice Palace forever. You finally go in and beat it without the big key and then find the big key in your next gen. Hey, sword! sword. You'll love to see it. Hmm. This lamp. I'm curious. I got to know. But it's, it's gotta be it. It has to be it. Oh yeah, absolutely. Fire Rod does not get you back there. It can't be anything else that gets nope. us our progression. A lamp blocks everything in this season. As soon as Captain Ooh. goes... Oh, that's a good find. Uh, as soon as Captain goes to Eastern again, that'll pretty much become clear and go, oh, oh, okay. 
And the Vanilla Skull Small still resides in Pinball Room. Captain and I recently had a uh, hammer on pad in Akraski's last weekend. It was glorious. Oh no, that sounds awful. That doesn't sound glorious at all. Also, no, I, it, I'm assuming it was required. I think it, oh, it's yeah. definitely required. I don't think you can go hammerless in without like door rando or something or glitches. Now, basically, that would mean that Ice Palace is an automatic crystal itself and pod as well. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Hey, you and Captain have been doing a lot of like co op proskies practice. Preparing. Yeah, just... Sorry about that, gun. Uh, just preparing for this tournament, I guess, and just having a good time, right? Mostly just having a good time, yeah. I mean, our solo keys oftentimes go faster than our co op, but co op is just <laughs> having fun. Like, you cooperate, you, and sometimes you get those like 135s. You're like, cool, feel good. Yeah. I still then, remember last season in League when it was the the retrant the co-op retrants or retro cross keys for uh, game two JP and I got like a mid one thirty co-op and it felt pretty heckin' good. Exactly. Then you got the solo one like I had a couple days ago and you're like, huh, that's faster than any co-op I've done by a half hour. <laughs> These do exist. Good seeds do exist. What the heck? All right, Captain making the very good call here, going back to Eastern Palace. Mm -hmm. Not much else you can do. You're, you're pretty much banking on your lamp out there, and then this will just confirm it. Not much going on race game, though. So... Oh, I don't really have that much left in logic at this point for this lamp to be... I'm very oh. confused. Yeah, um... I'm running out of ideas where this could possibly be. Um... Like, we found Ice Palace, but the, the Fire Rod's not in Logic, so we can't do anything there. We don't have Boots or Hook Shots, so we can't do anything in Mire. We found I the TR Big Chest, but, you know, no Hook Shot, no Samaria. We can't get to that. I mean, there are two possibilities that could kind of derail what we're thinking, and that is flippers or a glove. Right. That could be a concern. It doesn't have to be lamp, but probably. Like, okay. something you're going to get is leading to your lamp. Mm -hmm. Just one more step in the chain that gets us to what we need. Nothing here in King's Tomb. And Captain already utilizing that uh, mountain saving quit to head to the Dark World. Unfortunately, needs to head up to Skull Woods to get those goodies, but... Um, let's see what else... Yeah, we, there was just a couple keys along the way. And I believe this was the other side of Paradox? I believe so, yeah. The bottom. There goes one of Gilgamesh's ideas thinking, well, maybe it's the bottom of Paradox with the answer. Nope. And I, I don't think we've seen the other side of the, the quarreling, quarreling Brothers house. So I think that might be where we're at next, or we're heading to East Dark Worlds because we do have that hammer. Hmm. This is a which real old noodle scratcher. Which at this point still doesn't get us some logic at all. Uh, we have... We've seen everything... in desert... that we can get. Eastern's done. I don't think there's much more in logic in pod with another small key, right? No. I know nothing. Our bow is out of logic, so even the two out of logic checks Gilgamesh has are not mm -hmm. a thing. Like, East Dark World's not a thing. There's just one thing that they haven't done in the Light World. Both of them. They skipped one thing. What was it? I, I'm trying to think. Oh. <laughs> like, we, we just know, right? We've seen enough that it's gotta be 
one thing that they both happen to skip. Hmm. 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 Uh, I, I don't know. Pain of Samaria. That's a good find. Now we can get that tier big chest. <laughs> okay, so suddenly you get your moon pearl and mm. breadcrumbs galore. Get your hammer. Go south. Go east. Go north. Get your Samaria. Get, oh, get your, your boots. Your, your and booties. a sword. What the heck? Holy moly. Oh. So many goodies over in Pod. Oh, as as uh, Captain finds TR somewhere, TR East goes to West and ends up in uh, the Mire area. And we did see Quake was our Mire medallion, so can't even open up. up. There's Fairy Cave, maybe. Maybe we saw the other side of that from both players and just, well, no, going to the Mire area doesn't do anything for us. No, I mean, you have to get TR East to West, so it's still out of logic without the Samari that we found or Oakshot. There's Saha. Desert green. Green desert. Right. Saha with his usual words of wisdom, followed by nothing in the closet. <laughs> whole bunch of junk. The kid at Pod. Oh, we did. We do know where a bottle is, but it's way back up on the mountain. What the heck are we supposed to be doing, Lana? I'm supposed I don't to know. go. So I'm confused. so lost. I can pace it if I was running this, but watching two runners at the same time, you just miss little bits. Hmm. Well, we got a quake. Let's go in. What do we got? Nothing. Yay. Whole heap of nothing. The, oh man, three TR smalls. Definitely follow that somewhere. Get all the way to Laser Bridge and out the exit. Okay, this will tell us a little bit of information. If there's something where Gilgamesh is looking, then that would mean the hook shots somewhere. No. Nice ether. Uh, we also did see the other side of Fairy Cave led us to Desert North, which obviously no gloves, so we can't check the other entrance and get the small key on the ledge. We'll have to come back for that later. Another thing that would open up stuff would be the mirror. The mirror would open up quite a bit. Might even find that before lamp, maybe? I don't yeah. know. Erica, that's absolutely true. All right, we're gonna take that back exit, or are you gonna use your your cape here, Gilgamesh? Another pot small. Skull small. I think Gilgamesh wants his answers too. The swamp big. A good laser bridge. That's our last super useless Vicky. That may not be super useless. Oh, <laughs> oh no. that's not a good place to die right there. Uh, you hate to see it. <laughs> Bye. Forever forgotten. Not even going back to that fourth check or the back. I mean, you're out of magic, so if you're not comfortable with your laser skips, that's fine. <gasps> Bumper cave! Oh my god, this is That's our answer. the answer. They're both doing Let's... it right now. Well, one of them. I think. Gilgamesh was nearby. <laughs> He's got I... nothing off the torch, I think. Yeah, I forgot to. I think the torch is just a heart piece. There it is. We got our. Captain? This has to be our progression. This is it. This has got to be it. Like, just falling down or something. You're not even... Go north, scout what's up. <laughs> there you go. 20 bucks. It's fine. 
Oh, I can't. Oh, the big fish. Oh, the dead rock. That is the dead rock trying to tell him not to drop down the middle. <laughs> is the dead rock telling him to go left? Nah. Gotta drop down the middle. That's where the answer is, see? And... Okay, here's here's our lamp. First four checks, a thieves town coming up. Oh, we don't really have that many... We haven't found, what, GT... Para. We found ice. Back of skull. There's our fourth sword already. What the heck? Free seed. <laughs> so many swords. Oh, the downside for Captain doing all this is it's putting him off of skull longer. I mean, yeah. Every, every minute Gilgamesh has these boots is just a more time. And Gilgamesh has done quite a bit at this point. Dipping the skull woods, finding the goodies there. There's our swamp small. That's a good one. Gilgamesh is right behind. It's still not her lamp. Alright. Still looking. Yeah, so for anyone tuning in, we have we're we're still not in logic. We found a autologic bow at Dark Cross to get our, get ourselves a moon pearl off of the Armos Knights of Eastern, and uh, we are we're still looking. Well, that's not it either. And yeah, Captain's already been over to East Death Mountain, so all these checks are already done. So gonna have to go back up and. I don't know. Would you go back up again just for a spiral cave at this point? I think if you're captain, you know the likelihood of something very important, if nothing else logically being needed in that chest is, is the thing, but mm -hmm. I don't know. You have access to a lot of West Dark World. I think at this point, if you're captain, you just kind of... Okay, captain's gonna go up and just finish this off, but I think if it was me, I would just be like, okay, I'm done. There's something over there. I will get it as soon as I get a mirror. But the down, the upside to what Captain is doing is that if it does end up being a hook shot, it's much more important. Because there's hook shot cave, right? Because you can get a hook oh, shot. Yeah. Hook shot cave. Oh, there it is. Mini Mulder and Cave. Okay, so here it is, right, Willard? Right? Yeah. This, 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 this is, is it. it. We finally did it. Now, will Gilgamesh make the same play as Captain drop down the middle? This could be very important for Captain. But... But... We... Bombos? Oh Ice Palace! Ice Palace! <laughs> oh. Uh, I really... Part... I can't imagine Captain does that, though, over... Uh, West Dark World? I mean... No glove, no hammer. Yeah, it's such a bad call. You gotta assume he's gonna go to the Dark World, right? Especially if, as far as you know, you're probably... Oh, he's going for it, all right. I mean, it's gonna feel kind of bad if all you get out of this is, like, the lamp, but, you know, maybe you get the lamp out of the first chest, and then you can just book it, go do something else. Or Hookshot, I mean... Yeah. That's gotta be... go. That's gotta be Captain's mindset is I'm feeling a little behind, no matter what, because I did a lot. Triple Debbie's turn. You're thinking, well, my opponent just may skip this thinking it's lame. Maybe if it's a shot, could yep. be something. Might also get a glove here. Good. Mm, there it is, our right. Well, hmm. We're back in logic. <laughs> Captain, save and quit. Captain, leave. Yeah. Leave. Continuing in here feels not great. Especially because we know that, you know, Gilgamesh, whenever he gets around to doing this, if he does, um, we get to do it. Well, I can't, I don't know. Is he going? He's going for it. Oh, you can't do it at this point. You've been okay, no. too much time. He is not. Back to TR. I, don't, I wouldn't be going into Ice Palace without a glove, that's for sure. Especially when you have literally everything else for Ice Palace. Yeah, I, I, it's... Uh, I think you got that lamp, you just leave ice. It's just... You gotta be like, okay, there's probably just nothing else here. I'm gone. Mm -hmm. 
But I also understand it's really hard to, like, leave. And then, you know, the thought of, oh, but what if Ice Palace Big Chest had my glove? Or my hammer? Or my this? Exactly. I'm in Captain's mindset at this point as well. Gotta be thorough from now on. Yup. Small key to Ganon's Tower in the lava chest. It looks like we're heading up to the front. TR. Lava chest. Lava chest had a recent Samaria for me. That was quite nice. Captain, you're locked in. You're you're committed. Pod four. Uh, you gotta, yeah, okay, it's a mostly clearable pod for Gilgamesh anytime he wants to go back. Yeah, Gilgamesh is kind of in a pretty good spot at this point. Just needs to find, just needs to find that club, and then you could be feeling pretty dang good. So I don't know if Captain knows this bomb joke. Hey, look! <laughs> well, there it is. So it turns out, after getting that bow, Gilgamesh is pretty much done the right thing after the right thing after the right thing. But also remembers, does not have hookshot, well done. Yeah, once, uh, once Gilgamesh managed to get that bow, it's just like, well, I have a beatable dungeon, I should go do it, no matter what the prize is for it. And then That's everything just kind of... Fell in line. I mean, going for Skull Woods is a pretty safe play right away, especially when you already have Fire Rod and the Big Key. Feels pretty good. Exactly. You have to clear out the whole front. You hope for a good layout, which they got, and then there's your hammer, and then hammer locks your boots. And now Gilgamesh has a slightly orphaned but not horrible feeling catfish. You could always just go through desert right to get to catfish if you really want to go for it. But oh. I would I would definitely put it off until like mirror so I could do it with Zora maybe. Exactly. You, you <laughs> might have flippers in Oh god. Nobody's going to that TR front there. And even if you don't have flippers when you get back there, if you got a mirror and you know your splash deletes, you, you have more than enough to clear out all of uh, Zora area with minimal mm -hmm. buff. Where is Captain off to now? Hopefully this is heading to Hookshot Cave. Looks like it. And then we found a smith. A little smith down here under a rock. Oh. Alright, so suddenly Gilgamesh came. Clear ice, clear pod. You got your Samaria Icebreaker's the thing. You don't have to eat. You've got your ice big, so you can pull clear the dungeon pretty easily. You got a butter sword. A lot of firepower going on right now. Okay, Captain, you need to go to Skull Woods. And then you need to go to the pot area. <laughs> don't check anything in between. Yeah, just, just go skip everything. Exactly. Just psychically? No, no, north. North. Oh, you know what else we can go do now? We could yeah. we can full clear Meyer, right? As well? Uh, that's a fact, yeah. Boy, Gilgamesh. I don't know, was he... Did he get the item yet? Or... Died trying. I couldn't... I couldn't tell. I did not catch it. I couldn't tell if that was, like... Death warping after the chest or not. All right, Captain's making the right call. We're going to lift a rock on Gilgamesh's side and finally go to Ice Rock Gate area.
We still have we only found the one map, Willard? Like that sounds, that sounds correct, yes. Did That's we, it? And we didn't even check it. Or maybe well, it looks like Gilgamesh checked it. it. Looks like it is a crystal. We're slowly getting our dungeon info, bit by bit. And we're fake flipping on Gilgamesh's side. But not to go to the Zora area, but to go to North uh, Hyrule, so we can go check the uh, Death Mountain Ascension Cave. And maybe even... Well, we have normal Darkhold access with the, this item loadout, so... Yeah, it has a good amount of freedom to do what he wants pretty quickly, just no flute for easy Light World access at this point. Yeah. Could, um, could go check the first chest of Hookshot Cave. Yeah. And... True. <laughs> Would and you... if your hovering's up to snuff, get the other three. Would you want to, though? Oh, oh it's a hype oh. man. What's up, Johnny? Terrible. Your usual hype here, I assume. Biggie to desert. He just found desert north. Small key and... to thieves. That's always nice to get that before you get the big key. He was like, but I just found desert north and... <laughs> I was I... just there. It was just oh yeah okay looks like yeah I just same info on Kevin's side. Oh and now with that glove, Gilgamesh can get one more big key. Here, here, here. Get in, get in. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Even better. Now give us GT game. Yeah, where is GT? Dark Ice. Gotta be Dark Ice or Cave Under the Rock, calling it. Like, with your boots, you pretty much have access to the entirety of GT at this point. Yeah. So if, you know, if you know your bomb jumps left side, you're in good spot. Uh. Captain? I don't want to see a. Did he get his hammer? He did not. I I don't know what he did. It looked like he went in, got the big chest, the boomerang chest on the right, went through the back, and then went back through Skull Woods, but then didn't use the pot key to open up the door. This is not good. And didn't even drop down? I don't know. Couldn't tell you. Not ideal. Yeah, missing on that hammer is kind of unfortunate. It's, it's it's huge. Yeah, I mean mm -hmm. you could you could go to North Dark World and you could still splash elite and get that the boots, but you're still missing out on a hammer, which is you know everything. Oh yeah, the hammer that leads to the the Samaria and the boots. Kind of and rough. your your ice clear and your pod clear, mm -hmm. your Meyer clear. Yeah, and at this point, Gilgamesh is kind of kind of cruising. About to get his lamp, have a hearty laugh about, oh, that's, that's, well, he doesn't even know about Bombos yet. Where was Bombos again? Uh, that was the drop down. That, that was, was the mini spiral. Milner cave, yeah. Yeah, spiral drop down. Which, uh, Gilgamesh missed because he, like most people, did the middle drop down to get two entrances instead of one. I, I've been burned by that 50-50 enough times. Oh, yeah. That's to like... To complain about it. I, I have just started thinking, being like, okay, my 50-50 drop in the middle seems to be like a 60-40 left side drop. <laughs> Skip the two, to two check middle drop and just go left side. Just assume the game's being rude. All right, what else we got in Ice Palace? We are... We need a Thieves Town big. Uh, we need more maps. More. Several maps. At least five. Five more maps, please. Well, we have all of our dungeon um, entrances. 
So for what is it? If Swamp is a pendant, we may not need flippers or hookshot. Captain going back to pod. Interesting. I I I'm gonna go use that bow to check the two on the right and then the small key, which does get you to the back, but is not in logic. Another paw, a big key. There's our hair, a big key, so of course. We're gonna have to get all the big keys. Nice mushroom. Yeah, this is just another situation where unfortunately Captain's gonna end up triple dipping this dungeon while Gilgamesh is probably gonna get to only double dip it. And a lot of times, yeah, it's just, you know, luck of the draw, luck of the order. Just hit the it's right true. dungeons in the right order. That's true. I mean, at this point, Gilgamesh is looking for Thieves Big, possibly Hookshot, possibly Flipper, possibly, yeah, it does need Ice Rod. And a CT Small. And maybe Mirror? Maybe. What do, we're still missing GT, which we might not need, and Tower of Hera, which we might not need. Oh, uh, and back a skull, which we might not need. I don't know. Chances are we need one or two of those. Nah. Maybe. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, this would have been a unfun seed to play if you stayed in logic the whole time. I don't know. Like, it seems like staying in logic in this seed may have benefited you early, and it leads directly to the boots. Perhaps. It's the seeds that give you a bunch of front loaded items. But and the then it's like, like, which path do I take? I don't know. Yeah, exactly. And then like one of the off paths that you would have found if you stick to logic, you don't take. And that's a connector to Thieves Town that you don't get mm -hmm. to the last location. It's this seed almost. Oh, my God, it's a map. And it's a crystal. This seed almost seems like sticking in logic could have been quite beneficial in some ways. Yeah. Captain picking up Burna out of the big chest of Pod. Nothing else much yet here. And a shovel, okay. Both runners finding fetch quest, well done. That looks like a real quick pendant catch at Tower of Hera. Probably not what you want to see when you go into a, a, a pod dip that you can't clear the dungeon is just a fetch quest. How quickly does Captain go back to Skull? I mean, how I... much more could he do? Question is, where did we get that other Skull small? Not that that means that much, but maybe that'll push him in that direction. Is this back into Ice Pals? Wow. Oh my gosh! Triple dipping three different dungeons! This will get him a big key. To Hira. Which we haven't found yet. And a map. To Hira. No wait, map was on boss. Can't get map. I, I don't... Oh, I don't like this Ice Palace play at all. I don't but... know, maybe he's, maybe he's mentally marked the front of Skola on his checklist. <laughs> I don't know. I really don't know. I am very curious. We'll have to ask him about that. What the ice? What happened in Skullwoods? Cause he walked back through the front, and then just immediately saved and quit, which was interesting. I think was trying to figure out where he wanted to go next. Like, I, I feel like that might have just been a mental block. Just blocked out the entire front of Skull Woods. Could have been. I mean, may have saved him quite accidentally and been like, oh crap, well, now I'm committed to not doing Skull for a while. Because, I mean, at least 
if you were worried about the small key situation, because I mean, I could see him, he might even forgot that it's vanilla pinball key, uh, maybe? Because I know it's kind of scary to spend all your skull smalls in the, uh, if the possibility that you end up having a skull small good mode. Oh lordy, that's happened to me once. That's that, enough for me. I think that happened to me in last year's main tournament, me versus JP. I didn't even know, like, like I, I didn't even know I needed it. I happened to just randomly stumble across one in my last dungeon that I was go moding. I got bailed out. <laughs> I'm just saying. I got random pretty lucky. Mode, random loot for a gummo chest. It's like, oh, all right, it's skull small, that's fine. And then like, yeah. you're like, oh, oh. <laughs> I remember my face. I was like, oh, hey, there's a hook shot. Pure misery mine. Yeah, so that hammer just, oh my gosh. That is uh, the classic item blocking. Oh, and the flippers. Nice. Well, there's your swamp combo. We already found swamp and the dam, so that's a beatable swamp. That's just like a, a very constant with Mire. It's like, oh, how'd you get into Mire? Oh, I use the boots. Okay, hookshot's in here. Oh, how'd you get in Mire? Oh, I use the hookshot. Okay, boots are in here. But just kidding, it's actually the hammer. <laughs> Oh, I need a Meyer bag. Oh, it's vanilla. Oh, it's vanilla. Oh, where's Samaria? Oh, it's vanilla too. I think what I think... Question in chat. Why is it always that one place you miss that has critical progression? It's because I think the, the rando seed itself is programmed to, like, experience what you've done and change where the item locations are based on stuff. So like, oh man, that last chest in Laser Bridge, when Gilgamesh died, suddenly it has a required item. Just like that. Like, oh, you messed up here? Required item. Oh, I see you're coming back to go get it now. I, I turned it to 20 rupees. <laughs> got, <Exactly>. got him. <laughs> oh, you missed going out to TR West. Oh, it's in my area. I see you're doing Spike Cave in under an hour. 20 bucks. Spike cave two hours? Thieves Town big, big key right there. Exactly. Here's that big key I've been looking for for an hour for Goma. Somebody taught the rando, the AI to, to understand rando. It's adapting. It's growing too powerful. And that's the thing about cross keys I've learned in the past year. It's like, there are some things you just go in, you bite your tongue, you just go in, you do it. So you, you bite your toe? Well, your tongue. Okay. Well, I, I guess that's bad. I thought you said toe, and I was like, nope, I don't think you do that. Well, I don't like the expression... I don't like some of the expressions for, for things, so I just kind of think of alternatives which don't work out. Okay. <laughs> no, Fair enough, say, carry on. I, I didn't say toe, but... I heard toe, I, but carry on. You know, people... Anyway, move on. <laughs> but there's, like, things you do, there's things you don't do. Like, if you find an early Easter you go and you check one or two things. Mm -hmm. But you find a turtle rock, you got two smalls in the Samaria at the front, you're like, ah, no, no, I'm just leaving. And, eh, any decision you make on this mode can just bite you in the butt, because the yeah. game could be putting some stupid logic piece, like on a lamp in this one. Uh, and just one wrong decision will just change mm -hmm. everything. Yeah, it's tough, too. Because it's really easy to get discouraged when you make it, when, like, the last four seeds that you played, every decision you made just ended up being completely wrong. You're like, why are you doing this to me? When right. more often than not, it's easy to forget about all the good decisions that you did make, because you only focus on the bad. Exactly. Unless you, like, make a really big stupid play that somehow pays off, like a tile room gamble or something. Or you do ten seeds, you make the same call in nine seeds. There's nothing in that one spot, and on the ten seed you're like, I'm just gonna... Captain. No! Can't- uh, well. <laughs> well it's not Captain. gonna do much for you, Captain. But that's yeah. kinda neat. I mean, we don't need it because we've already found Meyer Axis. Well, at least Captain did. But yeah, I don't know- I don't know. I don't know why Captain's afraid of Skullwoods. I hope it's not just a mistake. I mean, we know it's a an unfortunate choice, but I hope it's not like a- Oh yeah, I forgot I could do that, you know, kind of thing. 
Okay, let's line up what the hammer's done for you. You get your boots. Mm -hmm. And you Samaria. Get your, you get your Samaria. Oh. You get your hookshot. Yeah, you, you get your flippers. Mm -hmm. you, uh, you get your glove. Mm -hmm. And several big keys. Oh. I remember what's up here. That is interesting enough to come back up here. Unless Captain didn't do... Captain might not have done the dark caves up here. So... I'm gonna find another bottle. Well, now go Ganesh has a beatable swap. Uh, fully. Mm -hmm. Gotta be able to go to Desert North, take care of that anytime he wants to. Yep. And can go beat Pod. Go beat Pod, whenever. So, deal the mesh. Uh, I'm Definitely back skull. in the driver's seat, also. I'm, I'm doing a great job tracking. Don't just ignore the fact that I just marked Eastern for, uh, for Captain. Don't, don't worry about it. It's not important. It's fine. Details. Captain finds a bottle. Yeah, oh, there it is. We knew where that was. We just didn't have a Loon Pearl, right? Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. We have not seen this connector here, but at this point, I don't think there's really any interesting connectors we're still looking for. We've kind of already seen all the good ones. We've seen Floating Island. We've seen TR Connector. We've seen uh, Bumper, Bumper Ledge. We've seen even Meyer area, so... Yeah, this is going to, like, TR back or something. We've already even seen Desert East, which is useless, so... Oh, yeah, TR. Oh, Hera. Oh, maybe we did see this. It was a dark side cave on, on Gilgamesh's side. No hammer. No hammer. Right. He already did bright side. That's fine. Uh -huh. No hammer. Go to Skull, Captain. Left side swamp. Small key to GT. That's GT4. And we don't know where it is. Oh, I don't, I don't think we want to know where it is. I think Captain's got lost. Yeah. Who go check Shovel. I uh, I don't know what Link Captain does in regards to note-taking. Um, do you have any idea, Lana, since you... Two tend to do a lot of co-op stuff together. I don't think he does any note taking. I think it's all tracker based. Oh, okay. I do some light notes on tracker myself, like on Donka Tracker. I'll like right click a thing and make a note about it mm -hmm. if I need if I need to, but I won't actually have like a notepad or something like that. Gotcha. And that sometimes bites me because I'll be thinking, what did I miss? And it ends up being TR West or something like that. I, uh, for a while now, I think even since, like, the last cross he's turned in, I think that's when I started doing it, maybe? Um, I started doing a, I think I originally was just doing a map tracker just to mark off green squares, and then, like, a notes tracker, like, taking notes, like, actually handwriting notes for dungeon locations and stuff like that. Um... And then I started using the Code Tracker web-based. It's like a map. I'm using it right now. Uh, where you can kind of drag icons onto a map. You can click green squares. So, because I realized, like, yes, having the written notes is helpful for if I, like, really need specific info right away. Um, but looking at a bunch of text can be a lot. So having a visual, a better visual aid for map tracking has been super beneficial. Captain's doing the thing. The only downside is I feel like sometimes I'm spending too much time taking notes instead of playing the game. I try my best to just take notes while it's in the screen mirror. transitions. Okay, well, the pendant. Okay, it's a pendant and a but a mirror. So minus myths checks. That is all the entrances available for Gilgamesh. Yup. Yup. The hammer for Captain. So in all likelihood, Gilgamesh is a thieves big from go. And that is also all the dungeon information for Gilgamesh, so... Um... We just need that ice rod, the thieves town big, and a castle tower small. Don't oh, yeah, have there's... to find Hera. Don't care about Hera. Yeah, get right, Hera. 
Get wrecked, Hera. Don't care about GT either, though. If I found it, I'd be... I'd probably clear as much of it as possible. Looking for... Your eventual go mode, Castle Tower Small. <laughs> I think Captain saved and quit and thought, Hey, I can go to Dark World from the south. No glove. No, no, no glove. That glove was in the front of Turtle Rock. Okay, so Captain's not out of this yet. Yeah, if, you never know. If the CT is small or the ice rod is just buried, Gilgamesh still has an advantage, but Captain could still come back from this. Mm hmm It looks like Captain's on the right path to go get that Canis Maria in the boots. And then just needs to go into TR and work his way to the front. Captain, go to pod area. That's where your boots are. He doesn't know that. He's going to do that. Oh, interesting. Gilgamesh, Russian boss. Then can go back in. Oh, kind of those small keys where you're only going to orphan one check and pod. And that check at that point is pretty dead to you. So <laughs> you're just never going back to pod after this. So choose wisely. Yeah, especially with the pod location. Though, you know, if we're, if we're not in Castle Tower small key go, you could always go back into pod after beating Aga Tower. Since they'll put on put you on the pyramid and then you can mirror. It's, it's if true. it comes to that. You hope it doesn't. But if it do, you got options. And that's the thing is if you're Gilgamesh, you're just hoping you find whatever you need in the dungeons that you're clearing. Because you exactly. uh you don't really want to find GT. At this point, it's like I don't really want to pull clear GT. Because I can't, and I don't want to. I think at this point, you're dungeon rushing. There's the boots and the final sword for Captain. Uh, if, if you're Gilgamesh, you're dungeon rushing, but you kind of do want to find GT just to have in your back pocket. You want to ignore it. Mm -hmm. Or maybe just do Stalfos to Compass Room and then leave. Because you're like, if at this point, Gilgamesh is running relatively low on checks. So if you do find GT, you don't necessarily do much of it. But I think if you find it, you either do a little bit and leave and go back, or you just leave it and go find Thieves Town, or go find your uh, your final dungeon. What is it? You... Oh, no, at this point, you know where all your dungeons are, so... Well, well there's the Castle Tower Small. Yeah, okay, there's one Pod of my answers. Pod. Now, one thing that Captain's going to get out of this that Gilgamesh didn't is the Sick Kid check. And if that ends up being, like, the Ice Rod or the Thieves Town big, that could be really beneficial for him. Or the other glove. Got that flute. It'll make it convenient. Let's see. Any bailouts for Captain? No. Blue Mail's nice. But not what you want. <laughs> Wait, where, where was the glove? Glove was in the front of TR. Right. So... Which, you know, that Samaria might send Cap in that direction. Either that or it might send him into Mire. Yeah, it's knocking out a few boots checks, looks like. Mire would be good, but Mire gives you flipper checks and hookshot checks without TR. So, if you're Captain, I think you're... If you're rooting for Captain, you gotta be open he goes to TR first. Yeah. Glove limits your options more than what TR opens. Or whatever it is, a uh, glove in the front of TR. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shovel from Pod gives us a map. It's a Ganister. <laughs> Great. And a Meyer map in the back of uh, Pod, thanks. Here's Canaburna, and then Shovel for Gilgamesh. And then, where's Gilgamesh gonna go next? Maybe we'll see a quick uh, trip up to Hookshot Cave, maybe? Four quick ones? I mean, I, 
remember if Gilgamesh checked the first chest or not. I mean, if you're Gilgamesh, you go minus two. So, yeah, I think you go for those density checks at this point. Yeah. Probably feel better to do that than to continue checking overworld, looking for these dungeons that you don't really want to clear. Exactly. Like you said, you could find GT, and then you kind of feel obligated if it's a bad location. Oh, we're going to get a fake powder. So this tells us that, yeah, he's going to probably check that mushroom, get that flute pretty quick. We are just looking for a Thieves Town Big and an Ice Rod. That is all we need on Gilgamesh's side. Bumps. Not too bad for a 135 into a seed. I'm going to laugh so hard if either of those two things are the last check on Laser Bridge. Because, I mean, here's, the, like, for the most part, Gilgamesh has had a pretty good time with this seed. He has not really had any big... Uh, setbacks, I'd say. Yeah, Moon Pearl got them both for quite a while, but once Gilgamesh went mid Eastern, pretty much been just on a on a rampage here. Mm -hmm. And not really doing anything bad or good, just following logic. Like, I think the worst thing that could be here for Gilgamesh would just be the Ice Rod. <laughs> Because when are you going to go back to that? But you might find the other side of uh, Laser Bridge just while you're out in the overworld doing stuff. But, I mean, what are the odds? Right. This also probably means that Captain's not going to go the other way into TR, depending on where uh, this kid... Well, he's just going to die. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I guess we'll never know. <laughs> Oh, I shouldn't laugh. I shouldn't laugh, but... Oh, well, you're not laughing at Captain. You're laughing at the fact that both of them died yes. in Laser Bridge. That's, that's, that's all. true. It looks like Gilgamesh is electing to go ahead and clear out the rest of the uh, castle tower here. Can't blame him. Uh, the only other entrances we haven't really seen... Okay, Gil that Gilgamesh did die trying to get this chest. Um, Only entrances we haven't seen from the runners... Like, where you could potentially pop out at would be, like, TR entrance, that one other TR, like, TR entrance main, TR entrance laser, those two spots. We could pop outside of Ganon's tower. Um, Pyramid Fairy, Ice Palace, uh, the... I don't think we've seen Greg or uh, King's Doom. Nope. Uh, I don't think we've seen... Have we seen Graveyard Ledge? I don't think so. Don't think so, no. Um, and then the and rock over in Dark Ice Rock. I don't think we've seen that either. Right. But all these have just recently become logically available on Gilgamesh's mm -hmm. side, so it's not surprising. I don't know. At this point, if you're Gilgamesh, as close to Gumbo as you are, you got four GT smalls and a big. I think you do your hookshot cave, and then you're just like, okay. Just look for GT and clear. Mm -hmm. At least at least the basement. Like, if you don't want to climb, that's fine. But the climb is worth nine items. I can't believe Captain's actually backtracking. Because, I mean, he could just save and quit and then flute back to Kakariko. True. Save a little bit of time there. But, like, what? GT's worth 32 items right now. Yeah. That's... Chances are one of those are going to be your Ice Palace or your, your Ice Rod or your, your Theus Pig. Getting our Aga one fight in. This is required because Ganon is at the Lumberjack drop down. So, gotta, gotta kill that one tree. Very important. I guess aside from Trinex, we've seen all the items in TR at this point, I believe. Except, yeah, yeah, that's it. So, yeah, I mean, worst case scenario, we get a very late mitts for a Smith Chain required Ice Rod or Thieves Town Big. 
at this point, you're probably just hoping it's in TR, or not TR, uh, Hera, or GT. Speaking of GT, there is Captain's um, third, I think, GT small. Alright, Castle Tower is done for Gilgamesh, required for that Ganon fight, so where are you going? I would assume this is going to be great... Hobo, yeah, 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 that's what I was saying. I mean, there's Sick Kid in the vicinity too, right? I can't imagine you'd run up to check Sick Kid at this point. I can't imagine you'd ever do that. We haven't it's... even seen Flipper checks either, yeah. Okay. Yeah. This is probably, like, you can go up to, like, Graveyard Ledge King's Tomb, then go over and do Catfish, Zora, all that stuff. Thanks for the 20, George. Yeah, I mean, we haven't even seen, like, the Capacity Fairy Chest either, or Entrance. Sometimes, you know, you could sequence for people fake flipper into there. See, I see if they can find some goodies early. It's true. I find myself doing that so little, though. Like, if you get early boots, maybe, but there's so much to do in a crash key I never find the time to actually fake Flipper very much. Yeah. If I, like... I... I don't know. I guess it depends. If I'm over in the Ice Rock Cave area and I've already been to, like, the East Palace area, I might do something like that. Otherwise, I tend to just go to Hobo and then swim up to East area. And if you got a flu early, it's a quick fake flipper to do whatever. Ooh. Oh, there we go. Oh. <laughs> Uncertainty. Oh. You saying no. Real quick uh, graveyard ledge, then then the double back, I would presume. I think so. There's too many checks in GT to yeah. right now. It's like about one sixth of your game right now. It's. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> Really? Really? You're doing Hera over GT. Hey, Hera's pretty quick if you if, if you if you skip if you if you do the Hera pot and all that stuff, and you don't have the small key, so you know, uh, it's a fire shield. That's good, right, Lana? No. 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 Whoop. <laughs> There's a wonderful human being by the name of Haim Cody. He made a wonderful patch for IPS. Any race, not race, any sort of seed I do, that is not a race. I patch it. What does it do? One thing. Removes it makes the it... swords or the shield sprite? No, it makes it so I can get my mirror shield eaten if I get it. Oh. <laughs> That's all it does. It's a good patch. And... And I love it. There's no animation for it. There's no shield eating animation. It's just gone. It, it just disappears. It. it just disappears into the oblivion. It's gone. That's great. <laughs> nice. I love it. I'm looking to try and like DM all the heads and be like, hey, can I get permission to use this in races? Because that's all this does. And they're like, eh, no. Probably, but. A legal maneuver. But, I mean, because you. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna do it without their permission, but I'm gonna I'm gonna see if they'll allow it. Alright, bit of a a nothing a nothing burger here at Tower of Error, just getting a Hyrule Castle small. Uh, we see Captain heading in the Meyer area, area, which is good. Or the Meyer Dungeon, we're gonna get hookshot and flippers on that side. I just thought of one thing for Gilgamesh uh, Willard. Mm -hmm. He's on the path of pedestal. Ugh. That's true. After catfish. <laughs> Well, you can, you can pull pedestal in three minutes. You can go down to desert north, beat it, and pull bed. Yeah, but GT. 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 GT's just gonna have ice rod and feast town big. Meanwhile, Captain is on the path for hookshot and flippers. And a second crystal. How about him? Unfortunately, oh. I'd say it's it's probably gonna take a bit of a of a miracle to uh, help Captain out in this race at this point. Just unfortunately, 
putting off the wrong things and the wrong dungeon order ending up double triple dipping certain dungeons um there were a couple bailouts like that sick kid like if sick kid had ice drop that would have been huge because that is such an awful out of the way check for gilgamesh that i can't imagine he's ever gonna go do it or a thieves bit yeah either of those two would have been yeah. huge but why are we doing tile room because it's funny see <laughs> oh no <laughs> back to hera oh it's next door though i guess right i mean to do one tile room to get to another tile room right just makes sense it just everybody's doing it these days it's the cool thing to do you gotta get that her piece I think when you're this far into a seed, if you full clear all of GT Basement and find nothing, that GT Climb is all of a sudden... I don't know, is it looking better or worse? I guess at this point, we have so little left that you just you just gotta go for the full clear at that point. You do. If you don't get your go mode in the basement, you bet on something being on the climb. Yeah. It's, like we said, nine checks, including the well. Uh, we also have, yeah, yeah, the Kakariko well. There's got to be at least one goal mode item between the two of those, right? Captain gets hookshot and flippers. Statistically, one if not both, yes. It's but crazy. Here... Like, all it takes is two chests with two good items, and Gilgamesh could be just a couple crystals away from goal mode, but this GT is having a whole heck of nothing. But, but if you're... Your Gilgamesh and you get, say, Thieves big in the basement and nothing else. Do you climb or do you go to Thieves thinking, eh, Ice Rod? Uh, I would probably go do Thieves. Where's Thieves again? Oh, Thieves is way up on the mountain. That kind of stinks. I mean, you would mirror, flute to Kakariko, go through Bumper Cave again, and then drop down. You could even still keep your portal to get back to GT if these towns not if it doesn't have the ice route in it. But yeah, that's I mean, that's always the tough part. It's the same with like all dungeons. When you're in an all dungeon seed and you're just looking for one more item for that pendant dungeon, and you're in GT, it's like you know, how much of the basement do I want to do before I just rush the top? Do I skip, like, tile room or something, or whatnot? <laughs> yeah, DT is not at a great location, because you don't have mitts. If you have mitts, it's easy to leave. Whatever. Hi, Silvers. How you doing? But at this point, like, I think even if you find one item or the other, if I'm Gilgamesh, I'm probably clearing the rest. And then, mm -hmm. going, then going to Thieves Town, assuming that one of the early checks is your Thieves Big. Because Thieves Town is technically four checks, whereas the climb is still worth ten, uh, nine. Man. What have we gotten down here? Silver's in a Hera small? Half magic. Half magic. Nice little bitty fight there from Captain. Gets another crystal. Oof. Oof. Oh, this GT statistically, uh, if it has nothing, oh my gosh. I mean, if you're Gilgamesh, like, and you find nothing in these next three checks, do you go back to Hero to do Basement to go back to GT to do the climb? No. I think you just do... Okay, well... Well... Alright, there's the Thieves Town big and the mitts. Oh! that question now comes I think to it, mind. I think you leave at this point. You got I, Thieves. You got I, yeah, I think I'd do the same. I think I'd bail, especially with the mitts now, because now getting back to GT it's, is it's super free. easy. Yeah. He doesn't have the flute that Captain has, but... Oh, yeah, you, that's true. It's, it's fine, though. You're in Kakariko with your star. It's a quick run. Mm-hmm. 
and it's not like go mode thieves town is much faster than full clear in the rest of it right it isn't i mean the only difference is you loot two chests and then yeah. you have to go one room further for a third that's yeah it's kind of like tr tr go mode is not that different than full clearing it just just it, like there's just very little difference yeah well at least in like a non-entrance yeah for sure like yeah, I gotta living... be. I gotta think that Gilgamesh, you know, despite how this seed's been going, it's probably feeling okay. To I would just go think ahead so. and go for this. I would think so. And Gilgamesh is doing the right thing in general. I mean, you find your moon pearl, and you're just following logic, and you're doing things as you can. Yeah, you, you didn't do GT immediately. You went and you found here. You didn't hear him, and then you did the right thing. You came to GT because you knew statistically, one or both of your items are here. This feels kind of bad if you finish and you get nothing from here or the well, and it's mm. just sitting in, in, in the back of these. But I mean, yeah, it's definitely a toss up. You know, if, uh, if you full clear top of GT and well and find nothing, and then go to Thieves Town, it would be faster than going to Thieves Town, beating it, finding nothing, and then coming back. Do it all that yeah. find nothing, so hey, it is. And frankly, if you find nothing here, you find nothing at Thieves Town, you go to the back of the desert, you do the rest of that, you turn in green pennant, you pull pad, you're still nah, uh, if, nah. efficient, you're, you're still being reasonably efficient. You gotta go look for back of skull, that's the that's the true answer. Well, that's true, actually. I, I forgot about that. We still don't know where skull is, do we? Yeah, those myths unlock everything 100%. Oh, yeah. so you're right. I didn't even think about that, because we're, we're still not in entrance go mode yet. We still need to find that dungeon, because it is a crystal. I didn't but think about that. We've got access to it mm -hmm. between the two runners. Like, on Captain's side, Gilgamesh, I don't think, has that Bombo. So, if the back of Skull is TR and that's Bombo, which we don't know, that's still True. something. Yeah. It's, it's pretty minor chance here, but you mm -hmm. know, we don't know yet. Captain's got a bit of a steep mountain to climb, catching up on these crystals, but you never know. It really just depends on where that last item ends up being, or that last entrance. Um, with that big key, we can go beat Thieves Town and also unlock Pyramid Fairy. So that's another possible Skullwoods entrance. That it is. Captain's off to next. Now at this point, the world is his oyster. Mm-hmm. Is, is he ready for uh, a third pod trip? Well, he needs to get that mirror. Doesn't have, you know, with the glove in hand now has a bunch of new entrances needs to check. So it's like he's gonna go run around and check those real quick. Was uh, the mirror on Armus Knights, was it? No. Um, Argus. Helma? Helma? Uh, right, the irony, right? Yeah, which is over on Dark Death Mountain. So this might be TR. I think you need a bumper. No, not bumper. Hyrule Castle. Yeah, that's it. Hyrule Castle to get you to Floating Island. And GT down for Gilgamesh, nothing on the climb, but is it the well? I can't wait for well to just have a book. Oh, God. Well, a book. I don't want them to find a book. That <laughs> could be the leading, or leading reading pet and then not pulling it. Why book? I want book to be on pet. What book? Or your ice rod off a tablet. Book. Funny book. Are we gonna get an ice rod? Are we gonna see a go mode? An item go mode here on Gilgamesh's screen? Not looking good so far. Three more checks. Uh, uh, ooh. <laughs> you hate to see it. Oh, 
Wow, that certainly um probably doesn't feel too hot. Where are we going now? Doesn't look like Gilgamesh is ready to commit to Thieves Town yet. Oh, catfish. This hour 54 minute catfish check. Oh, does he also... Oh, he's going to turn in Mushroom as well. He could also go in there and run all the way around and do uh, um, the Desert Big Chest. Oh my gosh. But... That's not happening. Because the better option would be to... Go to Catfish. Well, you're you're gonna do you're gonna do Zora next. You could go to Ice Rock Cave area, which is where Desert Left resides, and uh, get the big chest that way. But Catfish, you got anything for us? You got an Ice Rod for us? Uh... Yeah, me or Shield? <laughs> oh, even worse. Thank you, Gilgamesh. I appreciate it. Oh, you didn't bomb the catfish. That's disappointing. Do you remember where that castle tower small key was? Was it in a dun in a dungeon somewhere? It is. It's on the path. Which is Captain, on the path. Yeah, Captain will not miss it. I think. It's either here or... It's either here or Pod. Okay. I think. Alright, Zora had nothing. Now you go check, uh, like, Hylia Island. Pod boss. Yeah, that sounds correct. Yeah, we still haven't seen Hookshot Cave, have we? I don't think so. Nope. Oh, the worst is when you're this late into a seed and you still don't have all of your dungeons located. <laughs> yeah, but you have the tools at least now to do it. Mm hmm. Oh, moment of truth. Is it the Bombos? Nope. Ether. And the right call from chat, yeah, CT2 is on Helma, which is still locked behind another pod key we don't know. Is this Bombos? Oh, it's not. What do we got? Skullwoods? 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 No. The worst. Oh, what else is left to check up here for Gilgamesh? Just the rock left, I think. No, not even that. Spiral Cave. Oh, he hasn't gotten his uh, left side bomb, but uh, the oh, this is the Thieves Town, yeah. Oh, okay, it's Thieves Town. Right, right, right. Yeah, I guess if he wanted to go check Spiral and go back and do, like, Spike Cave, he could uh, take that Spectacle Cave connector, that Spitziata TR connector. It's almost like Gilgamesh is trying to be efficient. A fish! My god. Oh my goodness. The efficiency in Cross Keys, Willard. That sounds like an oxymoron. Yep, and had a little bit of trouble with the diver downs today. Should be able to get it. Getting that diagonal not to get in the right. There. Oh, not quite. I like the little swimming goggles. Adorable, yeah. And he's got like this little floaty on, if you didn't notice. <laughs> nice. I didn't even notice it until it was pointed out to me that it's got, like, the goggles and floaty. Oh, 
All right, just to catch everyone back up, what we are looking for right now on Gilgamesh's side is we need to find the Ice Rod so that we can beat Trinex. Then we need to find an entrance that homes the Mothula boss of Skull Woods. That's it. Those are the two big things. But where are they, Willard? I don't know. I didn't play the seed yet, Lana. Uh... We have Lake Hylia Ice Palace. We have some stuff over in the Dark Ice Rock Cave area that we haven't seen. Dragonborn. We, we have Smith, oh, desert, desert Smith left, right? Chain. And they... Hey, there's the Ice Rod. Boy, if only... I'm sure Gilgamesh wished he had left the GT and didn't do the upstairs. But, I mean... How are you? How was one to know? It's one of those things, right? You just... It's a gamble one way or the other. I wonder what he's looking for. I guess he hasn't been to the Meyer area, so maybe... Hoping to stumble upon... Uh, flute. Or Bombos. He can get flute any time he wants. Yeah. He did turn in the mushrooms, so... That is something he can check next time he's over in Village of Outcast. Right, Captain gets... A pendant! And a mirror. <clears throat> but where are we off to next? All right, so pedestals officially a dead. Wah, 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 wah. Everyone's crying about it. Boo -hoo, boo -hoo. The tears of chat. I, for one, am glad that pet is dead. Just saying. Just saying. Oh, I will say, uh, I I don't know what's worse, item go mode or entrance go mode in these type of seeds. Because, like... Yeah, so there's not a ton for the Gigamesh at this point for at least entrances. Yeah. It just always feels bad when you last locate your last dungeon entrance after, you know, two hours. I, I guess think I, I, I prefer would, entrance. Yeah, I do too because item go mode, you know, you might also also not be an entrance go mode because you might still need to find the entrance that has your item. <laughs> so exactly. it's a possibility. Or you may need to find the myths which hides your entrance, which has your items. It's a vicious cycle. Oh, Gilgamesh had just gone one screen up, could have gotten that flute. What are we doing here? Oh, I'm gonna go beat Trinex. Okay. That makes sense. Because he doesn't know where TR back goes out. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder, does he check that before killing Trinex? Just to see if it's the Meyer area? Which it wasn't. The left side is. <laughs> not the not the laser fridge side. The other exit, Gilgamesh. I'm yeah, kind of Gil surprised he hasn't checked the left exit in TR. That feels like a pretty early thing to do. I you know, if it's Desert West, that's our answer. Yeah, Gilgamesh could still need time to find it. Oh, Captain. Captain's going for it, though. Hasn't found Harry yet, but... Yeah, right now, for Captain, needs to... Head to King's Tomb. Let's go to GT to get... Aren't the Mitts in there as well? Yeah, Mitts are behind Ice Armos. Thieves oh big, yeah, I Mitts and was... Thieves Big. We're both behind yeah. Ice Armos. Yeah. And then you go to Thieves Town to get your Ice Rod. And then at some point you beat Pod to get your Castle Tower small. And then we're still looking for Skull Woods. <laughs> uh, we did see the... The rock lift on Captain's side at Dark Ice Rock Cave, so we know it's not there. At this point, oh, yeah. Lana, what would be the worst spot for it to be at? For Gilgamesh, Desert West. True. We did pop out of there. But you have to, but you'd have to get my access to get there. Oh no! The book! Oh, God! That's the worst thing you want to see if you're a captain. Oh. 
Kind of. I mean, you got the flute. It's a quick check. You got the mirror. Yeah, but we know it's not going to be important. We do. But given the dungeon locations, I could see Captain finding Kira and still beating it before doing or finding and doing duty right next to it. Because most people, Gilgamesh did King's Tomb, then Great Village. Most people did the opposite. True. True. There's Captain's Dungeon info. Alright, the hunt for Skull Woods begins! I would go Lake Hylia Ice Palace first. Oh, easily, yeah. Problem is that Gilgamesh does not have that flute! They can travel easier! Oh, not yeah. Gonna... So getting. Well. If you started like at Mountain Save and Quit, that's over at Dark uh, Dark Hylia. Then just Mir and you can go get those. But this is going to be the flute, which is going to work out for him. Yeah, this is pretty much what Gilgamesh needs for easier access without having to rely on TR West. Is that our first time actually seeing Hookshot Cave? Pretty sure, yes. We've got a map, arrows, heart piece... A jerk enemy. Very. I gotta imagine Gilgamesh is just gonna rush my area just because of the amount of entrances over there. I would think so, yeah, that'd be my first go. Because there's what, one, two, three, four, five, six entrances? Seven, mm -hmm. maybe? Captain gonna continue into Hookshot Cave to go. Wait, where did this. This led to Village of Outcasts. I don't it remember. Did, yeah. Oh yeah, it's a super bunny that gets you to the castle top for pod. And this will get Captain is here in GT entrance if he goes north. Doesn't need oh. it. Doesn't says that. See ya, sir. See ya. Right. Well, so I don't think I've seen this uh, on Captain's side. I don't think so either. Man, Nick Cave. But it will be checked. Captain's not in go. <laughs> At this point, this this could have nothing we care about. There's the 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 funny for Gilgamesh. Oh, this is just desert or TR left. I could have, I could have checked this forever ago. And only like an hour and fifty minutes ago. It's fine. Okay. We still have Desert Left and Desert Main. We haven't seen either of those entrances. Yep. This will be the other side of Fairy Cave, which is funny. Bombus tablet from uh, Captain. I don't think there's really anything Captain could find at this point that would be beneficial. No, nope. we know where half magic is. We know where. Well, everybody has all the swords. Not Desert West. Oh, I wonder what that small key on uh, Desert Ledge is then. Well, probably Meyer. Meyer, Pod, TR. Those are the only ones we haven't gotten all of them for. Oh, Captain's going to be following closely behind. And finding nothing. And finding nothing. Okay, we still have one more check in the desert entrance. Uh, nope. <laughs> Alright. Lake Highly Ice Palace. Then... Pier uh, Pyramid Fairy? Yeah, I think that's all we have left. We've already seen both runners found PR East and uh, Mimic Cave at the same time, so that area is out. <laughs> nope. Not bad. Uh, oh my gosh, this is so frustrating as a player. And... No. 
Here, Big Bay! Alright, back up the mountain. And Gilgamesh is about to balk. Wow. Green pen that turned it on Captain's side was just, uh, some nothing. Some nothing item. Captain, one pixel to the right in the game said no. Ooh, what are we going now? Oh, the Death Mountain Foothill Cave. Forbes. I almost forgot about that. This was such an early find that I just completely wrote it off. That's an easy one to skip and not even think about. But it's also Spiral Cave and therefore annoying. Are you all our Skull Woods? Yes. All right. And with that, two hours and ten minutes, Gilgamesh is officially in go mode. Just and now he's to beat this. That's it. Just has to beat up a boss and beat up another boss. And you know what's perfect is Ganon is well, right next door. Yep. Doesn't even have the mirror. Just has to lift the bomb to avoid the, uh, the portal and then just run it. No. Yep. It's fine. And meanwhile, Captain still needs to go to uh, King's Tomb to get the rest of his answers. Yeah. King's Tomb, Pod, Thieves Town. That's where a complete bait. And yeah, that also, like, that's t if you didn't write it down, like, that Spiral Cave being super important to go back to this moth as being a big jerk. What the heck? Get him out of here. He's got butter, sir. Why is he. Yeah, Gilgamesh, what are you doing? Hey, what's... Thank you. <laughs> there you go. We know it's only technically 10 for damage, but whatever. Well, there's our last tier small. Alright, so probably a minor small over... Very likely. Could be pod, like you said. Over a desert lake. Crystal, number seven for Gilgamesh. Time to fight the big pig. Not a terrible seed. Like, your Moon Pearl was the main difficult thing to find. Other than that, everything kind of fell into place. Yeah. I mean, the, the real big holdups here for a Gilgamesh was eventually getting to that Moon Pearl. A couple unfortunate deaths on Laser Bridge, in the Dark Cave, in the uh, Castle Tower. Um, spent a little bit of time getting that bow out of Dark Cross. And then just the inevitably finding Skull Woods, which is just, you know, just a coin toss. Maybe it's Ganon, Ganon didn't lie though. He said he took out Agnum twice. That that's not wrong. That's not wrong. We, we did. Oh, and also good for Captain and it would be finding Skull Woods much quicker than uh, Gilgamesh. Yeah, this means that the the myths are gonna mean nothing to Captain. If he decides not to well, we'll see if he does, but if he decides not to climb JT and just leave hoping price rod at the south. Short of climbing them, that would be Probably not that far behind. He still does have some dungeons to clean up, but... Gold Sword Silver's gonna put this pig down quick. Gets the Torch Glitch, too, to keep Ganon down in the corner. Which is always funny when he's like, just warps right to the next, the same spot again. They'll never find me, and GG's for Gilgamesh. Get your GG's in chat. Gilgamesh is gonna take... A W for the first week of the 2023 Cross Keys tourney. Let's also light this puppy up. Oh man! And Gil Gilgamesh finishes with a race time bet GG time of 213.02. See if we can get Gilgamesh here into voice. It's a first-hand talky-talk. And Moth goes down for Captain. While we're at this point, chat, make sure you go check out them runners if you haven't already. 
Um, you can click the links in chat, or if you want to hover over the uh, stream title, you can also click on their names that have been tagged. Follow them, check them out, watch them play some heckin' rando. <clears throat> I forget to follow Willer because you're obviously not doing it in this chat. He's been doing all the restreaming, the tracking, and the commentary. Uh, and the coffee drinking, of course. Coffee drinking, that's important. <laughs> uh, looks like Captain did throw in the towel, so we will be getting both runners in to do a little talkie talkie. Get your GGs in chat for Captain. Let's bring him down. Oh, you just said, oh, oh. I'm not in party time anymore. Take that. I have interrupted oh. your discussion to discuss Get with you. Get wrecked. How dare you? Get heckin' dumpster. GG's to both of you, Gilgamesh and Captain. Well done. GG's. How about that, G Pearl? Yeah, I was very confused at first, but I, I mean, I figured I there had to be another way up the mountain. <laughs> I just hadn't found it yet, but. Yeah, we had, yeah. uh, we'd forgotten a bit about that bumper cave. For a long time. I, I knew it was there. I just, it, it was never the one I wanted to take. So yeah. I, I kept putting it off. That's fair. We, oh boy, we spent so long just like, what the heck's our, what's our progression going to be? And then <laughs> we finally see Captain find Mini Moldern Cave at the Spiral Cave entrance. And it's like, okay, this has to be the lamp. And then it's heckin' Bombos. Like, get out of here. Yeah. Oh, I never, I never actually went in there. <laughs> no, you did not. The classic 50 yeah. 50 drop down there. You gotta make the choice, right? Yeah. Like, I always go for the two over the one. So. Same. Um, yeah, it's like, I get the fire rod that's lamp locked, and then I'm like, that's not anything I can do. Then I find the other connector up there, I'm like, well, that's about, oh, there is something in the ice palace. Oh, mm -hmm. crap. I was like, oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> we were kind of surprised to see you keep going in ice palace after getting that lamp. With the... Oh, did you get it? Did Captain get it earlier? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah, I, that was like I, you. You kind of yeah. After getting the bow, you got the bow and got Moon Pearl, and then, or did you, or did you get that before? I don't remember. Did you get that before or after getting the lamp? I got uh, that at, before. Okay. They both they both got it lamp last so, yeah. so I'm like, yeah, I'm missing the lamp somewhere. So I'm like, yeah. Because I got I got bombos after even after that. So. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah, it was it was interesting to see because it felt like once Gilgamesh got that moon pearl, it's like whatever the heck was my logical point to get to here, I don't care anymore. I'm just doing stuff. Pretty much, yeah. I was like, I I know there's another way up there, whether it be like flute in one of the entrances that I left or one of the few connectors that I hadn't checked. So I was like, eh, we'll get it along the way if it matters. Because right, at that I, point you're like it's either a hook shot or it's lamp. <laughs> lamp is yeah. somewhere, but lamp is maybe locked by something. Who knows? Yeah. <clears throat> and holy cow, that mire! Holy cow. The stacked yeah. mire. <laughs> there was some pretty good yeah. stuff in there. That was pretty good. It, uh, it's. I, oh, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, just a quick question though for Captain: What happened in Skull Woods? I, you know. <laughs> yeah. I. Uh, I love. Because I forgot to check the other thing. I, I don't know. Oh, okay, so it was just a, a an oopsie. Yeah, okay. pretty much. We were wondering because we saw you go in, do big chest and the the map chest, and then go go through the other connector, check the back, and then came back through the front. But then you kind of like yeah. left the Skullwoods area and then saved and quit. I just, I just, yeah, I just. Oh kinda, no! Yeah, that definitely up, up, hurt up, you right far, yeah. a lot. Like that was, because you know, hammer immediately led to Samaria and boots. And yeah. Then, mm -hmm. um, that led to Meyer. Yeah. That led to everything. Mm -hmm. Yep. So, just kind of a really unfortunate turn of events there. Um, Gilgamesh, at that point, I think had already done, had already found those items and was, I think, I think had already cleared ice and maybe it was maybe around Meyer at that point. So, you know, mm -hmm. still had a couple crystals ahead um so mm -hmm. it would have been I mean, interesting to see things. i'm missing three things so i mean you know so i'm i don't know what it's where it so, was, so ganon's tower was at king's tomb that had uh your thieves town big. big 
behind Ice Rod. Ice Rod. Ice Rod was next to yeah, Blind yeah. Inner Prison, yeah. and then Castle Tower Two was on Helma. I mean, I'm literally standing on top of Bumper Cave. That was my next check. Was yeah, check those mirror spots. So I figured <laughs> you did find Skull Woods a lot faster than Gilgamesh did. Gilgamesh did almost every check first. Uh, pretty much, I pretty. have, I have Dark World Bonk Rocks by the Bomb Shop. Mm -hmm. I have one item in Dark, sh one in Dark Shopping Mall, and uh, the Pyramid Fairy entrance, which I was never going to find because I forgot to mark where the Bomb Shop was. Oh, <laughs> I was really hoping it was not going to be there. Oh man. The bomb shop was uh, West Death Mountain, one of the drop downs. Okay. The drop I mean, down I would have I would have looked over my VOD for it if it came down to it, uh, but yeah, as, as my entrances were starting to shrink, I was like, oh no. <laughs> there were mm -hmm. like two potential outs for you, Captain. One, at least we were like hoping something would be in these spots because Gilgamesh was like never gonna go there for a while. One was the last item and. Uh, laser bridge. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> yep. Um, but it ended up being funny because Captain also died before getting the last two, so you guys both kind of got lasered. Um, it ended up being nothing anyway. And then Sick Kid, because I don't know when Gilgamesh was ever going to go back to Sick Kid. Oh, never, dude. That was the war as soon as I opened Pod, I kind of <laughs> rolled my eyes and said, "Well, <laughs> see you never." <laughs> see you never. So. I think Sick Kid had the other mail upgrade. Okay. So, um, yeah. yeah. Bit of a stinker. Yeah. I, but... I mean, I, I did, I didn't expect to win, so it, you know, it, it is what it is. So I, I know my skills are way below Gilgamesh, so it's fine. Hey, it's if you found big. that hammer when when you were there it would have been a pretty close <laughs> yeah race, honestly honestly. you never know with cross keys mm -hmm. too like I, I once i was you know frantically searching for that skull woods interest so i was like oh i, I go keep my eye on the race time room because i was like oh this is starting to feel real bad here yeah um i mean and also one of my least favorite things about cross keys is never getting any maps until after you cleared all the dungeons oh, yeah. <laughs> they were I'm so like, late to show up. i was oh like look at all these gosh, clearable yeah. dungeons i have well i guess i just have to go do them and cross my fingers and then no, no, I, 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 what I did was swamp too i was like yeah I don't know if this is a pendant or oh, i think yeah, that was the only was funny. the only pendant that you guys got that you didn't know was a pendant was swamp but Luckily, it's fine. Had it mirror, had the so, mirror, yeah. so yeah, it was it was kind of good. Um, yeah, I, I required anyway. Yeah. Honestly, the missing the hammer kind of led you to doing a few extra double dips uh, that Gilgamesh didn't have to do. So was, I think before you got to Skull Woods, like the only real things that put you behind was the going back to Eastern for the big chest and the vanilla big key chest that you died getting to. So the, mm -hmm. you triple dipped Eastern, so that was a little bit mm. of a setback. And then the extended trip into Ice Palace without Samaria, Hammer, or Glove, or any of that. Yeah, the Ice Palace was rough, right? Because I, I mean, I definitely thought about it, getting that fire rod so early. But man, going into Ice Palace without Hammer or a Glove, it just feels like Pretty super bad. rotten. Yeah. yeah, so I was putting it off, hope, hoping that I would find at least one or the other. And luckily, I ended up finding both before I went into Ice you, you know, when I bomb jumped across the spec rock connector, found that sword, I'm like, oh, yeah. That was great. I liked that. Oh, yeah. we love that. <laughs> Willard and I both were like, oh, hi. Because by then, Gilgamesh had already fallen and just taken the, the enter the connector, but uh, did not bomb yeah. jump across. And then and, the and swords then just ended up being pretty free anyway. There was a lot of swords early. Yeah, there were quite oh, a lot I of mean, swords. Yeah. The only sword... Like, oh. Oh no, you guys both got all gold. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. but yeah, GG's both guys. That was a fun race. Glad I got yeah, to. Yeah, thanks for restreaming. To restream it. Thanks yeah, again. Thank you. For uh, if you do go back and watch, uh, I didn't know you guys were doing no delay, so I was getting coffee while you guys started. Oh, sorry. I, that's I. That's why I was like making sure you were ready before we started. <laughs> oh, I was probably I probably missed that in the race room because I was cropping and then. That's a, that's my B, so it's fine. You know, <laughs> nothing happened at the beginning that. anyway. Honestly, nothing what happened. Was, oh, look at all these dungeons in Kakariko that we can't do anything yeah. in, and that was it. I think it was like the first. Yeah. I popped back in at like a minute and a half and saw you guys go, and I was like, oh, well, interesting. Where's Eastern? Here it is. Okay. <laughs> there it is. All right, cool. Yep. Yeah, it's 
I was in the Eastern like the first minute because that was the first entrance I checked. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, GG's to both guys. Good luck in your following weeks in the Cross Keys tournament. Thank you. Yeah, can't wait to get Andy next week. Sweet. <laughs> All right. No, that'll be me. What are you talking about? We're both on one. It's fine. Dang, I should have joined this tournament. I didn't know delay was an option. That changes everything. Uh, it was like the last year, too. It was optional, if, as long as both uh, players... Yeah, well, I don't remember anything from last year. Come on. Okay, all right. It's so long ago. <laughs> all right. How dare all right. you? Uh, once again, chat, make sure you go check out the runners. Go, go, go support them. Go tell them they're cool. You can tell them they're cool right now, if you want. Uh, you can also tell my Cocom wannabe that they are also cool. And to go um, follow likewise, likewise, and appreciate it. And don't forget to, you know, if you're watching this on YouTube, hit that like button for Willie. I mean, yeah, lot. ring the bell. Do it. Also, do the things. Lana, Lana, I hope you appreciate me dodging that mirror shield because I really thought about picking it up, and then I remember you were coming. So Easy I, dodge. I, Easy dodge, Willie. Willard can vouch. I was like, thank you, Gilgamesh. <laughs> but you didn't comment, so nobody. Point. You already died on Laser Bridge. You didn't need the mirror shield anyway. It's true. I, I I had a couple stupid deaths in this one. That one and the one in Castle Tower, but yeah, it happens. Yeah, Captain almost died in Dark Cross getting that bow, and I was scared for my life. I almost did too, actually. Oh I was I was like a half a heart or something. Same like with that Captain. Before I got it. Yep. Just throwing yep. boomerangs out like crazy. I'm like, is he gonna get I know. it? <laughs> and Captain had a sword, had a sword. going in. <laughs> oh yeah, see, I didn't have a sword at the time, so yeah. that's my excuse. Oh, well, Captain got bullied by the ropes on the way down. Yeah. Classic ropes. Sure. Always doing a bullying. All right. Thanks again. Y'all have a great rest of your Monday. Thanks. GG's off. Hey. Bye, everyone. Bye. All right. GG. Go. Thanks again, Lana. Likewise, my friend. It's been a pleasure. Yeah. We'll catch you later. Later, everybody. Wow. What a fun restream. I'm going to go back to bed now. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you for watching. <laughs>